are watching a few showers across the state this afternoon. Here's a look at downtown Albuquerque where we haven't seen much shower activity yet, but we have, as we put this into motion, seen the cloud deck start to lower and we are starting to see some of that shower activity over toward the Sandias as that cloud deck continues to get closer and closer to the ground. That's one thing that we've had to work with throughout the day is try to get some of that moisture that's in the upper levels of the atmosphere to make it all the way down to the ground so we can finally start to get some shower activity going at the lower elevations and we'll eventually start to see that happen in Albuquerque throughout the afternoon. 54 degrees the current temperature, a south-southeast wind at 7 miles per hour. Temperatures across the north mainly in the 40s, although we have a few locations in the 50s, such as Farmington and Cortez, and over toward Clayton as well. Down to the south, mainly in the 50s and 60s, and despite the mild day, we do have that chance at a few showers and even a little bit of snow over the northern mountains. We've already seen a little bit of that snow in areas like Ski Santa Fe earlier on this morning, and we are starting to see those snow showers develop even more over areas like the Jemez and over toward the San Greta Cristo mountains. The snow levels are rather high because we are so warm, so we're looking at snow mainly above 9,000 feet. Otherwise, we're looking at rainfall, and that's what's moving through the central portion of the state right now, and that's our shot at showers in Albuquerque throughout the afternoon. And that storm really is not very strong. In fact, it's still making its way through Arizona and will continue to cross through this afternoon and this evening, and then we're watching another storm behind that. So we'll have a shot at a few scattered showers throughout the afternoon today. It will be breezy at times. Then our next storm drops into the eastern portion of the state for your Saturday, and it looks like the east will be favored for the shower activity here, and we're really going to boost up the winds throughout tomorrow afternoon and into the evening as well. So super storm tracks showing those showers in the western and central portions of the state for this afternoon. They continue to work their way through, but they do start to fall apart as we move into the evening hours, so we'll start to see the activity diminish. And then the second round comes in into the northeastern part of the state by tomorrow afternoon and through tomorrow evening, working its way down eastern New Mexico. Could even get a couple of quick snow showers as far south as the Sacramento Mountains, but the east slopes of the northern mountains favored for the most snowfall. And then by the time we reach Sunday, Sunday afternoon things quieting down. And here's a look at the winds because that's going to be the bigger story with that second storm over the weekend. The wind's not doing much through at least tonight and into early tomorrow, but by tomorrow afternoon, we really start to see those winds blow up across western New Mexico. They eventually make their way into the eastern portion of the state, especially the northeast and east central areas by tomorrow evening. And then we'll continue to deal with some breezy conditions through Sunday morning before things eventually start to calm down by the afternoon. Here's a look at southern Colorado for today. We'll have a chance at a scattered mix throughout the afternoon that continues into early tomorrow and then clearing out and warming up for early next week. Over the northwest, mostly cloudy with scattered showers and storms possible. Highs into the 50s. We start to clear out over the weekend and back to near 70 degrees by Monday. Over the southwest, partly cloudy skies. Isolated storms will be a good possibility. Highs into the 60s. Back to the low 50s for Sunday before rebounding to the upper 60s into the middle of next week. Over the southeast, partly sunny skies. Highs into the 60s and 70s. We'll have a better shot at showers here early in the day on Sunday as temperatures drop to the low 60s, then back to near 80 degrees to start next week week over the northeast. Mostly cloudy skies, spot afternoon showers and storms, better chances over the weekend with that second storm system, and then we'll start to see those temperatures rebound for early next week. Over the northern mountains, we'll be looking at that snow at the higher peaks throughout the day today and through the weekend, and then showers through the weekend as well. Over the east mountains, scattered rain showers will continue through the afternoon, and the metro will have our shot at picking up a couple of showers and storms throughout the afternoon as well. We'll have a shot late in the day Saturday with that next storm system, but most of the action will be out to the east, and then things do quiet down for early next week with temperatures warming to near 70 degrees. Okay, thanks, John.